ISO 20022 is sweeping the globe to become the most premier messaging standard that we have, especially within the payments area. Now, uh, it's not just the um, payment messaging standard itself, it's also the implication that you need to take as a bank uh, to cater for your internal functionality and uh, value from this messaging standard that uh, I'm going to discuss a little bit here. Due to historical reasons, most banks have a rather ancient or old messaging platform inside of their bank. This platform has been operational for many, many years, um, but mostly tuned and adopted towards the current messaging standard that Swift uses called MT. Now, this new ISO 20022 messaging standard will be much larger in size, which will put strain on the infrastructure itself. And as we all know, most of our business processes that we have today will move to a more instant world. So from a messaging point of view, this will put even more strain on this platform. However, it's not just these internal aspects that will be affected because uh, from historical reasons, uh, Swift has played a very dominant role in being basically the only messaging network outside of the bank. But now there are both uh, competing messaging networks to Swift as well as sort of more additional on top of uh, networks. This means that uh, you need to have a messaging platform inside of the bank that are able to route between multiple different external networks. And as we all know, the messaging platform is under constant cost pressure. So you need to have both uh, speed, you need to cater for this new ISO 20022 and to do it at an even lower cost. So now might be the right point in time to consider whether your current messaging infrastructure is the right one for you moving into the future or if you need to transform it to become even more capable. If you want to read more uh, about this topic, please have a look at the attached blog post.